Hi everybody, um, I just got done with surgery a couple of hours ago. I'm um, already on my way home. My mom's actually getting me um, almond milk latte right now. So I wanted to chat with you. Uh, so my hand is gone. Um, I already had a phantom pain, which was a little strange. It wasn't really a pain, it just felt like my fingers were closing. So that was kind of funny. But um, I just want to give a huge, huge um, shout out to the uh, Harrison Medical Center in Silverdale. Every single person we came in contact with was just amazing angels, seriously. Um, every single person, the nurse, doctor, the anesthesiologist, the people at the front desk were just so kind. Um, so lesson from today is you have to do what you love. Um, you know, we've all had a bad customer service experience, but when you can see people who love what they love, you know, love what they do, they're amazing. So don't ever stick with a job that you're unhappy with. Um, and um, basically, um, I'm really excited to start my new journey. Um, you know, without my hand, it was emotional, but um, I'm in I'm in super good spirits. And you, know, for people who have cancer or have to lose a body part or whatever other disease, you just have to think that um, you know if it it's for the best. So you could be sad, you can mourn, and you can do what you need to just don't live in that sadness and just think you know your life is more important than whatever body part it is that you need to get rid of and you can still honor your um your body um, my my dad's wife suggested we do a little celebration of life for my hand so probably tomorrow we're going to go um, to the water and just say a prayer and it'll be good. Um, I'm definitely on some meds now, so um, if you if you think I look good and, and sound good, it's because they're working. Um, but I mean, posit you know, positively, I feel I feel great. So anyway, thanks so much uh, for watching and love you guys, and I'll be chatting with you soon. Bye.